What's up guys, Jamie here, Ability Off-Road. Coming up, we travel from Karatha, 270 kilometers south to Nanyatara. We overnight there behind the truck stop at the caravan park and check out the Ashburton River that runs right past. And then the next day, push on to Chila Plain Station Stay, 180 kilometers east. on from Karatha and had a pretty decent week. Got on top of a few things this morning. We filled up the water tanks, checked over the vans ready for the 270 kilometer trip south to Nanyatara. Pretty nice weather today, 26 degrees, not too much wind, good day for towing. The front of the caravan is not very aerodynamic, so it's nice not to have too much wind dragging it down. I still have to give you guys a rig rundown of the caravan modifications and want to explain why we build it the way we have. I just want to do it properly so to stay tuned. I'll get that done eventually. It's our first time with the cameras and it's harder than it looks for sure. Hopefully the more we do it, the more we can get used to it. We'll stop for some lunch up ahead and push on to Nanyatara and in the morning I'll take you guys down to the river to check out the Ashburton, one of the main rivers in the Pilbara. This was camp last night. It's pretty boggy here. We're at Nanya Tara, small campground. I see the wheelchair tracks here. They're getting a bit stuck. All goes through here with the same tracks. Not a bad little campground. Massive grassed area. Not really, it's pretty tiny. In between the vans there. Bailey just having his medication. Naps just packing down the awning. Go around the camp and have a quick look. Nanyatara, it's a station. See the mountains over there in the background. There was cows here last night. You could hear them. I don't know how close they got. And this is where we were. Morning, buddy. Anyway, I'll see if I can get down the river here before these cameras run out. I went across yesterday and had a look at the river from the old highway bridge. I tried to get down there yesterday. I got a feeling that the glow deep inside my core needs to breathe to flow. We push it right on through. I know you need it to because we have been working hard right from the very start. Stay out until it's late We've come a long, long way So we deserve it, mate Call it a day and celebrate
did ever slow us down We knew we'd get here Went the extra mile in every race We are duty but See it properly Cross over here Cruise on down Some nice gum trees here On the edge of the river Lots of rocks A few birds All these birds here the river's not flowing, but there is water in it. We'll see if we can get under that bridge. I don't know if I can get through that gully there. I'll make sure we've got service on the phone in case I get stuck. Yeah, we're good. A couple of bars. We'll keep going down here. Hoping to see some cattle or some livestock. A bit of a hill I'm going down at the moment. Really quiet down here. Oh yeah, we can get across go up a little bit, we'll go down here on an angle, make sure we don't get stuck. Let's see how close we can get. I can see, I'll see if I can lift the camera up a bit. You can just see a little bit of water down there. See how high the bridge is. I'll see if I can go under the bridge. Get a bit of a bit of a better view. Yeah, so I just Googled it. 1879. It was started here. 1879. 1500 sheep. A fella and his wife drove the sheep up from Moore River. Looks like we can get under here. I don't want to go too close to the edge there. A little bit of a flat spot to turn. I'll put my drink bottle in my mouth. I'll hold the tray up. See that there? And a little bit of water here. That's probably maybe 40 metres across. But it's probably 200 metres wide, the river. Just a little bit of water on this side still. A bit off camera here. I'll turn and see if I can get a better shot down the side. Of... We'll go back to camp. We've got a 170 kilometres today. We're going to Chula Plains cattle station. You can camp there, powered sites. And hopefully, my health's good enough, I can get in the buggy. And um, there's some four wheel drive tracks on that station. I think it's 188,000 hectares. Yeah, I've never stayed on a station before. I've only ever stayed on farms. So I'm looking forward to that. I don't know how old the station is. Find all that when we get there. And I hope there's some old stuff, yeah, different stuff to look at. Take the Hilux and we can go just off exploring in the, all around the station. Yeah, that'd be cool. Take me back, take me back to the old dirt road Where mama and papa used to go Let's sing all them songs from a long time ago And pine for them old days of yore Well let me run through the breeze like the leaves on let me fly like the leaves when they fall Well, let my mind go serene Like a cool water stream That runs from the mountain so tall Oh, take me back down the old dirt road Take me home to rest where the mockingbirds nest and to cry through the green in the spring. Let's go back a ways to the old by 
bygone days and the simple time we lived back when. Now we're heading off again, we're probably 50 k's from Chill Plains. Yeah, yeah, landscape just keeps changing, it goes mountainous, like ranges, and then it goes back to flat, long stretches of road, single lane bridge. Slow down here, it looks like it's a bit rough. No water. It looks like way in the distance there. Take me back down the old dirt road. Old car here.
got to copy, Ann. Driver window down. Go down. How far do you want to go? All the way to the entrance or? All the way to the campsite, probably. Um, shall we just drive straight past and into the camp? Come in. Okay. Right here, Nath. Toby's waiting for you. He'll show you where to go. Copy that. I know, away we go. Chiller Plains, pretty excited about this. Thanks for watching our Pilbara road trip videos. Being in a wheelchair, you're pretty limited to where you can go and what you can see. But we just try to do what we can and see the places that we can find access and get to. The weather in the Pilbara has been spot on. We are here for the next three nights and I'll try to get as much information for you guys about Chila Plains so you can plan trips for yourselves. That's it for now and be sure to check out the next one.